Grand Rising, y'all. It is Vlogmas Day 3. It is now about 9.33. Alexa, what time is it? It's 9.35 a.m. It's 9.35 a.m. So, this morning was interesting. I just dropped the baby off. Um, I went to McDonald's, got all the way to the, to the register. They said that they wasn't accepting cars. So I went to Burger King. This is my first time eating at Burger King. I got a number one, which was the sausage egg and cheese croissant meal and then i got a mocha iced coffee to go with it i, I thought i rolled over a squirrel i thought i killed a squirrel today y'all i was traumatized my son he had to give me pep talks all the way to school i was like just out of it he was like well maybe you just rolled over the fur maybe it was just a bump in the road and that wasn't what it was so when i drove back i went to check and see if the squirrel was out there and the squirrel was not out there so i'm really hoping that it made it across it was two squirrels and one of them um went the other way and then the other squirrel ran in the street mm, i don't like it i don't like it it's giving chocolate milk i don't like it mcdonald's would never initially i was gonna do I wanted to go to Burlington and look at that stuff, but I'm looking at this room. Baby, this room a mess. So, we gonna clean. Well, y'all gonna watch while I clean, because I need accountability at this point, because this is too much. So I'm gonna eat my food, eat my breakfast. This is salty, but this is why I go to McDonald's. Quick side note, y'all. I've literally been wearing this wrist brace for like two days. Um... I sleep in it. I put it on at night. I do like my little bandage wrap for my eczema on my hand. And then I put this on. When I tell y'all my wrist is almost back to normal, it is crazy. I've been suffering for like two freaking weeks before I actually got the brace because I thought it was just going to go away. This, this, this brace is the truth. This brace is the truth. I forgot the name of it. I'm thinking like two more nights of sleep and I'm going to be good to go. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I just want to let y'all know that. I know y'all was worried about me. I'm doing better. Got it on right now. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Hey, y'all. Uh, don't do that. Because I told y'all it looked crazy, okay? A lot of stuff piled up, up. But we finna get it together. I'm also going to bring the couch back out because I bought a chair. And the chair didn't fit in the space. It fit in the space. But it wasn't big enough. I want something where me and my baby could, you know, sit together and watch TV. Watch a movie or something like that. this floor i'm gonna separate these clothes because these clothes need to get washed thank y'all for being here with me because it's really making me move it's really putting some fire and desire where it needs to be so now let's get these clothes separated so we can take them up and at least start the loads this is a long time i'm not sure been separated everything this is the hair stuff this is miscellaneous school stuff um that's my babies this is like jewelry stuff that was in a trip this is perfume this is a mason Cravalli 
perfume sample kit that I had bought because I wanted to try one of their samples out. Um, Peyton had me wanting to try out um, Papyrus Molecular. And it was okay, but I couldn't really get a sense of the smell because they gave me like... When I put it on me, it was just too much. And then my dumb ass was like kept spraying it in different spots. And I ended up having a little reaction. So shut up. So I got these little test strips um, so that I could test out each individual fragrance so that I could have a better sense of what it smells like. This is miscellaneous. These are tools, little strips and stuff like that. I need to hang my baby loofah back up on the shower wall. And then this is like camera electronic stuff. I'm thinking about throwing this away because my headphones just broke. So why would I keep it? I don't know. That's the baby hoarder in me. Yeah, so now I'm about to find a spot for all of this stuff so that I could just go ahead and clean it all up. So that the only thing that's on this floor is closed. So then I can start my low. Hey, y'all. So, got all the stuff off the floor. Put it where it needs to be. I got the stuff I got to take upstairs and put in the area we keep like the beauty stuff at. I'm going to take this load of clothes up. I'm going to start with the dark. I changed my shirt because it was dark and I'm going to wash it with the darks. Sarah, yeah, I know that I'm going to end up taking a break, editing the footage that I have so far, and then continue on. Oh, yeah. Let's go wash. from yesterday i know at the beginning of the video i said it was vlogmas day three initially this video was supposed to go up yesterday but as the time progressed i knew that it wasn't going to be enough time so it's rolling over and now it's going to be vlogmas day four so yesterday i washed all the clothes on my day some of them on camera as y'all saw the rest of it i did off camera i was literally washing until like midnight the comforters and everything like that so let me go ahead and show you guys really quickly as y'all could see this is just the robe that i was wearing this is the comforter all of this it's called the my baby decided he wanted to sit in here and crack the damn thing on the side. But it still do what it needs to do. These are all the clothes, towels. This is a whole basket full of my clothes. So, those are my baby clothes. So, if you watched the vlog for day three, then you'll know that I was folding these clothes. I actually did finish folding these clothes. So, all my baby clothes are folded. I know he has some dirty clothes upstairs. These right here hello so these right here are the towels that i got from home goods these are my favorite favorite towels for him he has these towels already but i wanted to get him some more towels these were at home goods they are quick dry Let me make sure you can see it in the camera they are quick dry towels i love them they don't have like that little you know, sometimes you'll get out the shower and you'll have like the little fuzzies from the towel on it. Very, very nice. It is definitely super soft. And look at the price, y'all. Can't beat it. So now what has happened is a lot of the miscellaneous stuff I actually put in my nail desk area or on my nail desk area. So now I need to clean my nail desk area off. It's a lot of little getting stuff together. The bulk of the stuff is done. And I thank y'all.
finally done. Yes, the bed is wrinkled. That's because I laid in it debating on whether or not this is about to be Vlogmas Day 5. This room is nowhere near complete, but I definitely needed some accountability so that I could actually do some deep cleaning. So I hope you guys enjoyed this clean with me for Vlogmas Day 4. And I hope you guys have a wonderful remainder of your October and every day after that. Oh,